friends welcome back to another video and in this video i'll be quickly setting up reviewing and doing the speed test of the iris scanner present on the galaxy s8 plus so it has a fingerprint scanner on the back and the iris scanner on the front top so let's quickly enter the pattern and go into the settings of the device and remove any previous iris data that is present in the phone so quickly clicking on the iris data remove and going back and also resetting the screen type and setting it up to swipe lock so now quickly we'll be again going to the iris scanner and it tells us to set up the iris data we'll be using the pattern so let's use a l pattern for the security point and click confirm so here it tells me to get ready to unlock your phone with a glance hold your phone 25 to 35 cm away and don't wear eye glasses so quickly i'll be positioning my eyes into the circles and it registers myself even with the camera recording the screen and i was not fully visible to the iris scan it still registers me very fast so it tells me some tips what i should do and what i should not do and always try to keep the iris scanner clean quickly clicking on done and one very important thing that you have to click here iris unlock when the screen turns on so if you enable this then as soon as you will press the power button the iris scanner will be activated else you will have to swipe and then the iris scanner will activate so quickly doing the speed test and you can see look here to use irises and as soon as i look here it unlocks so the speed over here is very fast and it adopts patterns and as more you use it the more faster it gets so you can see here that even when i am pressing the power button it is unlocking in an instance so once again i'll be pressing the power button again press it and again turning it towards myself and it unlocks it so once again so you can see i brought it a little closer to my eyes and it recognizes me very fast so the speed i think is much faster than the fingerprint scanner and is definitely a very good improvement over the galaxy note 7's iris scanner so we'll be reducing the amount of light we have reduced the number of lights and we'll be testing in low light and you can again see that the response even after reducing the light to a minimal condition the response time of the iris scanner is very good so once again i'll be unlocking and clicking on the power button and as soon as i click it unlocks so in note 7 whenever i used to unlock it it used to give me that screen in which my eyes used to come on the camera and then it used to unlock here i am not even getting that screen and as soon as i press the power button if the position of the phone is perfect or not even perfect then also it unlocks the phone very fast so quickly i'll be switching off the entire lights and i'll be using a totally dark room so stay connected to see how it performs in total darkness so quickly i'll be locking the phone pressing and you can see the speed over here also it is very fast the moment i click the power button even with no light in room not a single light it still performs like a charm so kudos to samsung for making such a brilliant iris scanner and i am very sure that i'll not be using the fingerprint because it is very badly and very oddly placed and the iris scanner performance is perfect in every light condition so i'll definitely be using iris scanner as the primary security in my galaxy s8 plus The superb performance of the iris scanner compensates for the inaccurately placed fingerprint scanner. I hope the video was helpful and if you like my work please hit the subscribe button. Thanks for all the support you have given me. Stay connected.